They have another crush. They're not gonna bother. Oh, they are. They're gonna bother. That's a crush, number two. And that's the open wounds, and that's first blood. Minus two. Pit of Malice. Doesn't look like it's gonna happen, but okay. You're going in. Crush. Oh, that's a frostbite. Gets a crush, but. And now what? Journey around the world, dot fights. Oh, rain of fire. Oh, he does he take. Oh, there's the rockets. So they got him. So. How much time was that? That was a really long chase, though. And the mid laner got it, which is nice, but. Yeah, it's a support slot. It's like. Inge light, going back in. Crystal Maiden. Core popping the shrine for himself. We got Life Stealer. Munching away the Calling Blade. Paparazzi. Oh, wait. My bad. I missed that one. Kirsch. Gonna be chased down there. Slaughter just getting sprint. On top of cloning. Oh, super. Gonna get caught out here. Frostbite stacking the stuns there. The Curse of the Silent activates. And now Dog Fights is here. Finds the crush. Onto that lion, that's going to be a 25 and a wall as well. Fancy meeting you here. There are illusions. The dot fights. Oh no, the and returns the wave to the dots here. What's Chris doing? Oh, meanwhile, inside another minus two happening. S baby super now with the plus six. Got to TP out of there. Dot fights gonna take that look on themselves with. But uh, Paparazzi is still looking for a kill. The Curse of the Silent is going to slow him down. There's the Malice. The Shrine immediately deployed. And now they TP heroes in. It's been a bait. And the Omni Slash. Alright, so they do get they do get a Slaughter kill. But they baited out the Shrine. And they finally get the kill. Slaughter. Still trying to look for targets here. Lion is in the neighborhood. Ready to lock him down. The Jug is far away. Oh, meanwhile, middle lane, they get the Tinker at last. How did they catch him? Surge, alright. So they surge in on- They're all looking at Darks here. Regen, you scan. Siege Crystal Maiden, oh, immediately crushes onto her, the Life Sealer goes in. Knocks out the Crystal Maiden, and now the Vacuum as well, they kill off a Lion. 6 and 3. A very simple game here, so far. For- Still going to play. Goes for the open wounds for the heal. Oh, Darcia. Be careful, Darcia. But meanwhile, they get the lion. Tinker. Still farming. Look at that net worth. It's heavily favoring uh, the Radiant. Bleak Dagger on OD now. What's he have? Hurricane Pike. Lion dies again. They got that. Jump stun on him, and they are immediately backing off. Okay. It's time to actually run into this. Oh, they're gonna run into the pit lord. It has to be careful here. So gonna wrap around. Look for Tinker, maybe. Oh, they found him! They found him! They crushed him, and they got him! High ground defense, halted. And now Daylight is going in there. There's the finger of death. The silence is there as well. The mech keeps them all tip top. And now Caesar, Caesar in trouble. So is Rubble. And there's the crush. There's the slash as well. Life Stealer is going ham. He has Omni Slash. Has to be very careful. The Surge definitely taking their foothold in this game. Golgraph at 20,000 net worth change. And there's the OD. Hurricane Pikes in there. Nukes down the Obsidian Destroyer. Blows up CM. IGV in trouble. Amplified damage. Laughs at Juggernaut's bad attempts to fight. And uh, the Rockets are going out. There's doing quite a bit of damage. They hex him up. There is no Dazzle, there is no Grave. Nice infest dodge. No, the vacuum! The slaughter is there as well. Lion disappears and so does the Juggernaut. Sakata cleans up on Owls 3 and 4. And IGV are looking to mop themselves up a game number 1 as the brown player calls GG. Damn, that was a massacre. And a Tinker going down as well. 16 to 3. IGV, a slow game from them. Methodical. But in the end, they managed to pull around two to three decisive team fights later, and they got this game in the back 24 minutes in, and with plenty of time to spare. And uh, they're gonna grab themselves in a nice cuppa, coffee, tea, or whatever, smoke.
and uh, we'll be right back game number two I'm watching GPL on Lysander and uh, yeah that was a short game we'll see you guys in game number two hopefully they put up a better fight and uh, yeah we see better I wouldn't say better games but yeah hopefully they put up a better fight and we'll see you guys in the next one don't go anywhere much love and cap they're gonna try and steal this bounty rune and they might get it, but they're going to walk up front with the Nyx Assassin. And do you have the damage? No, you don't. The stun goes out. They tag the PA. That's going to be a crush. It locks three down. Looks like Slada will offer himself instead. That's three Napalm stacks. It's a lot of Napalm, though. They're four now. There's another stun in one second. Five. Give me the five. There you go. Five is up. And they stun him. Is there another dispel? There's not going to be enough. The miss. And there you go. Again, Crystal Maiden. Scoring first blood. And uh, we start this game off for here. Yeah. Gonna look to punish this sniper's aggressive positioning. And Le Yuan doesn't see this one coming. Still trying to do the fancy smanshi here. There's a wraparound here in the back line. But they already got your sniper, bro. Short raise gets him. And now the slaughter coming in. Level 2 slaughter. Is there a follow-up? Nope, there isn't. There's a crush. Crush number 1. And uh, he has another short raise, though. Oh, shrine. Tags up Sakata. Sakata has to be careful here. Gets hit by a Purifying Flame. He is healing up, but another Purifying Flame finds him. And so that's a one for one. The Sniper... And the Crystal Maiden looking for another push here. Has that uh, Observer Watch plopped down. Gonna have the mana for the... For the Frostbite Crystal Nova combo very, very shortly. Clockwork looking for that... Looking for that Crystal Maiden. And the Observer... Let's scout up the Clockwork right away and now call... And it scuffed it out, immediately backing off there. Oh, my bad. Missing that kill on the Nyx Assassin. The PA with the Blightstone. Gonna have enough damage to pick him off. Oh, the slow coming in and in July in trouble. Pops the fire down. Do they get the kill? There is uh, Cloak. He does have the Purifying Flames. Gotta find him. Take him down very low and the Dagger will find him. And that's it. Another kill there for the safe lane. FTDC striking back there. Showing that they have claws. Oh, meanwhile, Core in a lot of trouble. There's the Frostbite as well. Paparazzi gonna get brought down there. Crystal Maiden getting the last hit. In July, though. Be careful. Oh, looking for the kill here. Trying to find a SF. There is no assassinate, so it's going to be a tough one. They're diving the tower for this one. There is the shrapnel. Long race missing. Short race tagging. And now Sakata gets brought down very nicely. Done by eight. CM's back in there. Gets another kill. One more right click will do the job. No, nope, high ground. One more. CM tosses. Tosses the snowball over. And in July, in trouble. There's another purifying flame. And little gets the kill. Super. It's pretty cool. She's got to feed illusion money. Illusions are no longer free, buddy. Uh, meanwhile, Nyx Assassin chased out here by the Slaughter and the PA. Spikes. Where are the spikes? Spikes! Spikes it perfectly. And, uh, should survive. Poor Man Shield being a cockroach. Easy survival. But now we have a gang coming in. The Crystal Maiden summons her illusions. Sends them in. This is trouble here. We'll look for Slaughter. Nope, we're gonna stun the Oracle first. The Frostbite on him. Tags him up. He gets brought down. A right click from in July. Gets him. Meanwhile, Shadow Fiend gets a hit by the Assassinate. They're looking for Kirsch. They're still looking for him. Another Frostbite. They find him and they walk him over with the fire. There's the stick charges. They find him with the Impale though. PA. Gonna find that kill. The tower will take him out. And in the end, uh, it will be a 1 for 2 there. They're gonna look for the PA. Uh, look for the next Assassin. But he is pretty darn tanky. So, not gonna kill him for now. And uh, Core. Boots of Speed and the Poor Man's Shield. Just very vulnerable to this Lifestealer. Level 7 face boots. Building into that Midas. I think it's done. Is it done? No, it's not done. But uh, PA finally going down. Three heroes on one. So they um, three man the PA. She falls under the pressure. Oracle getting that D ward. Suspecting some fishy observer action here. Sakata eh, trying to keep hold on to that. Trying to hold on to that um, clarity potion. But in the end, might actually get brought down himself. Save. Oh, I have to be careful. Gets a double race there. Kills off. The Shadow Fiend, but now Crystal made it in trouble. That's a big streak to give away. And look, you are getting so many kills. But there's the Napalm in trouble. Now the first hit crit there. That's going to be delicious. But Nyx Assassin walks right in there and collects a free kill. So many kills there. There's an Impale as well. Oracle, where did you think you were going? And now Law gets brought down. <clears throat> Yeah, 
and there you go. Support has to come. Support has arrived, and they're gonna look at Core here, but meanwhile, they found another kill there. The Oracle gonna get found by the Nyx Assassin as well as the kill, and now they're gonna look for a Bat Rider as well. They realize that they're being flanked. The hook shot is still there. Could look for a kill. The slows come out. There's gonna be a slaughter. Find that kill. Walking behind the birds. So he will actually get himself out of there in time. No, the NCs block the hook. And the Crystal Maiden with the baits. They all get out. 8 to 11. IGV. Stalin. Okay, just kidding. Bat Rider dies. Oh, he's so short. Do you see that? Okay. Yeah, FTDC. They Jumping over to him. Do they get the kill? That's the spike. Spike. Spikes the slaughter. So slaughter's gonna give up his life instead then. But uh, they might actually get the kill. The sniper is here to save the day. Bat Rider's gonna fall. The sun goes out. Life Stealer gets another kill. They get it. Frostbite. Gonna look for the PA. Yo, Mana Burn. They killed off the PA. Infest Bomb. Immediately. But now, there's so much reinforcements coming in. FTTC. They're bringing their whole team. Paparazzi in trouble. They lose their Life Stealer. But this is not something you wanna get. The spike goes out. They stun up the sniper. And we go in. Vendetta. And uh-huh, looking for the slaughter. It is an easy one again as well. The spike comes out. He doesn't even get a chance to crush. Life Stealer gets himself some Shushi. Very nicely done there. FTT will be a little bit vulnerable to that. Uh, CM trying to inch forward there. Looking to pull the creep wave aggro. Yeah, he will actually do that in time now. Oh, what's up? What's up? Shadow Fiend gets the kill on to the Clockwork. Right, with the double damage, a very easy pick here. Oh, gonna TP away. Will there be... Uh, the eternal question, but uh, the answer is going to be no. Looks like Koi is going to be feeding here. They're going to walk right over. Gonna punch him in the face as well as the impale. That's going to start the impale. Not going to leave anything to chance. And they get him. They even damage the, the, damage the neutrals to pull him over. Slaughter. No blink dagger just yet. Has to be careful. And because of that arcane rune, the vendetta is almost off cooldown again. Zakata still farming here. Oh, poor Crystal Maiden going down, but now Sniper is going to pay for killing the girl. The little girl, yeah, the lasso is there as well. What a good crush, a three-man crush. Not good enough, though, as the Sniper still pops. Now it's the Oracle, trying to run away. He disarms himself, but he says, I surrender. No, sir, Paparazzi takes no prisoners. The stun is lost, so the PA will get away in time. Blinking away to you, sir. Going to, going to the sneaky sneaky again. Slaughter, running up and down, running up the high ground, face checking. Shadow Fiend is there, the hook shot will find him, and that's a big one again, but that's a BKB, brother! That's a BKB and a double damage, picking the wrong fight! And now with that Amplify dittering something like this, but it does seem like a fool's errand. Gonna munch away, and there's gonna be the Spike Carapace, stuns up the- Oh no, stuns up the PA with their Spike Carapace, two shots him! Holy crap, and now Le Yuan trying to get the kills there from the high ground, Going for that high ground snipe there, walking into the shrapnel with that spike carapace. This Nyx Assassin just offers so much utility. And he's probably going to tick now because of that. But Sakata, meanwhile, oh, he found someone on that south side. They're looking to wrap around this Radiant Shrine. The Radiant thinking they have this in the bag. They're going to find that shrine. And there's the Raccoon of Souls. Lo Yuan immediately pieces out. They're going to lose Slaughter. They're going to try and kill the CM before that happens. A Frostbite could happen. A four second Frostbite. And he pops to that life stealer, so they lose three heroes, oh, yeah, they lose three heroes, 4-2, do not pop the A, the face rush lineup, you can almost imagine, yeah, for, for the dire, and again, the Nyx is on the hunt, oh, no, Oracle, goodbye, sir, pull it up, down he goes, down he goes, a four staff now for the Crystal Maiden, she makes something useful out of this, but they do have observers scouting all this out, and here comes the Bat Rider, pulls the mask of madness, sniper, four stuff, this bro! Paparazzi takes him out with a mega kill. And now 15 to 24, the sniper down, the best high ground defense. Really long time unless the tower goes down. The tower might go down there by the PA, but the PA not around. Oh no, Slaughter getting caught out, but immediately bailed out here by the Oracle. So that will be the Oracle ulti down. IG still banging away on the front door. There is Aegis. There is Aegis. Lasso, so, 25 seconds. Nyx Assassin has the four stuff. He has a lot of stuff. Oh, there's the hook shot. They're going in there. That's a three shot there on the clock. What goodbye, sir? Sakata pops his BKB. His Aegis is down, but does it really matter because all the opposition is down as well. Four stuff. A little bit off on that four stuff there. Be careful. Dogfight's gonna spike that one just a little bit. And he will have to blink away in time. The tag. FDDC. Just look outclassed.
right now in July. Looking for another pick. Oh no, LWW says, please spare me, bro. I'm not sure the clock wants to be part of this. Uh oh, super in trouble. Oh, they're going in. They got the Crystal Maiden, but they're gonna pay. They're gonna pay dearly for this. Not blur enough. And now, Slaughter trying to blink there at the edge of the rush pit. Gets spiked up by the Nyx Assassin. Smacked down by Paparazzi, and they only get a Crystal Maiden in trade. 69 seconds left. Uh, Stunts the Sniper. And they see him. There is no lasso though. So they will not be able to punish that positioning. But uh, Paparazzi got to get hooked in here. There's a Rage. Immediately banging away on those cogs. And oh, poor clockwork. Amplified damage though. We'll keep things interesting for now. There's Paparazzi going into the creeps. Whoa, whoa. Dodging it there. Nyx Assassin coming in. Blinking in with the Spike Carapace. Just to stun Slather on his own crush. And Sakata really not giving a damn here about this sniper. Again, the Spike Carapace. This is a sniper in trouble. They immediately bail him with the Oracle. Oh, Sakata winds up the Raccoon. It's not going to be enough. It's just going to be a little bit of harassment. Okay, Loyu, and you are not high health enough to engage that high. But uh, meanwhile, Lifestealer and Black Rider being objective gamers. Beating away at the Rexus. Paparazzi is dropping low, though. Oh, okay. That was embarrassing. <laughs> he goes down, so there's that. Nope, there's a spike carapace. Spike carapace? Nope, just gonna force stuff down. Doesn't even get corrosive hazed up, and now there we go. Chasing onto the poor Crystal Maiden. Crystal Feeden, ladies and gentlemen. Crystal Feeden. Going down for an extra 222 gold. Le Yuan will survive. They keep one range Rex. Refusing to call GG right now. Oh, wait, spike carapace? Oh, 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 oh. There you go, GG. Nyx Assassin will stay alive, maybe. Will he be saved by the bell? That's the question. Missing, missing, missing. Saved by the bell? Nope, the rocket gets him. Clockwork will go down again. And uh, this game ends in a crushing defeat here for FDTC. As uh, IG Vitality cruise over the series with an easy 2-0. 27 minutes for the second game. 24 minutes and 53 seconds for the first game, I think. Very easy matches for them. And... Uh, yeah, warm up bait, that's what I like to say. So, nothing really too much to analyze about this. I think it was.